YouTube was crack, man. It's your boy Devin Hughes here. Um, so we're gonna look at uh ten worst WWE World Rumble 2017 booking matches. Um, if you guys wanna follow me on Instagram, you know what to do. The link. So let me shut up and do the reaction. World Rumble 2017. It was a great show, but in some cases, it, it felt like we were fucked. Uh, and I feel yes, we right were. Now. I really do. Even though the matches were pretty damn amazing, WWE pissed off their fans. And I'm gonna complain about it on YouTube. 10 Worst Royal Rumble 2017 Booking Decisions. Oh, decisions, okay. Owens can't win clean. You know what the fuck is wrong with this? Kevin Owens was portrayed to be as one of the greatest heels in the WWE. He's a tough guy, not a pussy. Because, no, most of the time, heels are pussies. Kevin Owens, when he debuted on the main roster against John Cena, he was, a, he was not a pussy. That's what I'm trying to say. I mean, it's not The Undertaker. Why can't you just let him win clean against Roman Reigns? Right. It's like the company has just Roman given up. Reaction. Now, this one is, you know, bad. But I loved it, and I think you loved it. Uh, Strowman uh, interferes in a Kevin Owens versus Roman Reigns match, and he, instead of getting booed, everybody thanked Strowman. Thank you, Strowman. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. Strowman, I love you. <laughs> no returns. Royal Rumble is an event when we see a lot of you know, returns. Every I was so pissed about that um, last Sunday, because... You have plenty of opportunities to allow new up-and-coming stars or veteran superstars to return the Royal Rumble, but unfortunately, that did not happen, and I was very pissed about it. When they showed number 30, I thought it was going to be Samoan Joe, but it turns out to be... <sighs> Never mind. Here there are thousands of videos on YouTube, uh, guys who should return to the Royal Rumble, and this time, no one did. At least no one that we would give a shit about. Where's Finn Balor? Where's Samoa Joe? N nothing. <laughs> we, we, we got nothing. Lame returns. Yeah. Do you always, uh, do y'all also remember the rumors about Kurt Angle, you know, returning to the uh, Royal Rumble this year? Look at that turn out. I've said we had no returns, but I mentioned that we didn't have any good returns. Now, we did got some returns from Mark Henry. That was not a return. We got returns from Mark Henry. That was trash. Thank you, WWE. I'm gonna go fuck myself. Big free at the end. So Undertaker, Brock Lesnar, Goldberg, all of these guys came at the end, which is shitty. I was I mean, really mad really about bad. that, man. First of all, we all I, know who know, best. Looking back in my reaction video, I was full on supporting The Undertaker because he was the favorable superstar to win the Royal Rumble. And uh, unfortunately, Roman Reigns had to mess all of that up if it wasn't for him eliminating Taker. Which is something that really, really rubbed me the wrong way. Just just a, a big slap to the face. Like the guy was this close of winning. But so it's got to be that certain super care that got to ruin everything. Spots. Second of all, at least one of these guys should have been like number 10 or something, so we would have him the whole match. You know, Goldberg came and he was eliminated pretty damn quickly. Reigns in Rumble. So I think Lord. this is the first time I've ever seen a guy who had a WWE World Title Universal Title opportunity at Royal Rumble and at the same time was in the Royal Rumble match later that night. I mean, this is just not um, uh, authority bullshit. This is like seriously 
he seriously feels like he's given uh, stuff in storyline, like the authority is giving him stuff, which is not supposed to happen because they hate this guy. And uh, not only that, there's another bad thing about it. Reigns as 30. Holy exactly. shit. Exactly. What? What the fuck? So the authority hates Roman Reigns. They never liked Reigns. So we will give you an opportunity for the Universal the guys, Championship. Like trash. And you're gonna be the last guy in the Royal Rumble because we don't want you to win. So you so we are giving you the best spot, the last, when the clear when the ring is cleared, you know. It doesn't make any sense, but that's not, not, not that's not what pisses me off. What pisses me off is that they ruined everything with Reigns. Why would he be in the Royal Rumble? And at number thirty, that that's 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 what I'm talking about. Number thirty, Roman Reigns. Bad yeah, num yeah number thirty was we not ever that great. Balor, Samoa Joe, Shelton Benjamin, John Morrison, anyone. anyone it could have been anybody, but any, anyone, freaking Hornswoggle, why Roman Reigns? Something new. <laughs> we get Roman Reigns, the guy. Everybody hate this guy in this arena. Like he, he, we got. We hate bullshit. him and John Cena. This is bullshit, and it is. It smells like shit. It is shit. We wanted Samoa Joe. We got another Samoa instead. Holy shit! Reigns eliminations. <laughs> this is not over yet, right? This is not over. Roman Reigns comes into the Royal Rumble, second opportunity of the night, the biggest opportunity, being the 30 in the Royal Rumble and getting an actual title match in the same pay-per-view. I, I don't understand it. <laughs> That's not all. You see, he eliminates Chris Jericho, one of the biggest potential winners of the Royal Rumble, and he eliminates... It, it, it feels... I'm gonna throw up just by saying that. I'm gonna throw up just by saying that. He eliminates... The Undertaker, the greatest wrestling creation, The Undertaker. Mm. You know the guy was dead. You know the guy who just put himself yeah, out. Yeah, I'm of sure the he's going to be hit by you know, everybody he as he is right now. Out of the ground. Because the way he, he did to The Undertaker, money, so he started wrestling. That really this pissed me off. This guy was eliminated by Reigns. I feel bad. Last man standing. First of all, I'm completely okay with Randy Orton winning. One of my favorites yep. of all time. I love this guy. That felt really damn gay, by the way. <laughs> but you have all these potential yeah. winners of the world. And you know what? I don't mind Randy Orton winning the 2017 Royal Rumble. I think I think somebody said that John Cena to drop the championship title at the Elimination Chamber. I'm hoping that it's true. Because if it's not, then I'm not looking forward to seeing him and Randy battling at WrestleMania. Because I'm really getting sick and tired of just seeing the two together. Like, I don't care how long these two have been rivals. I just want the title off of Cena because... I would rather see Bray Wyatt and Randy, I mean, Bray Wyatt and Randy Orton, you know, compete at WrestleMania for the, WrestleMania for the championship. But, um, Randy Orton winning the 2017 Royal Rumble was alright with me. I, I, but I still hate the pay-per-view, the whole thing in general. What was that? And uh, <laughs> uh, we thought we're gonna get at least one of these guys at the end, or anyone really, Chris Jericho. But we got a guy who had an opportunity in the same night, Roman Reigns being a final two with uh, Randy Orton and Bray Wyatt. Like, we thought, like, what the fuck is going on? This, this is bad. At least he didn't want, you know, Roman Reigns did not want, thank freaking God. But uh, it, it was really damn bad. I think the last man uh, standing, if Randy Orton was in the Rumble, should have been Randy Orton and Bray Wyatt, or Randy Orton and Chris Jericho. So that would be a shocker as well. You know, Jericho doesn't win, what the fuck. It just felt bad, like I don't think he deserves it at all. And I'm gonna say it uh, uh, quite honestly. I'm, gonna, I don't, I'm not gonna script myself. This guy ruined the Royal Rumble. Roman Reigns. He and did. Jericho sleeping. What the heck was that? Last Sleep year man. or the year after that, Fresh Jericho was in the Royal Rumble the whole match, and I didn't saw him sleeping. Now he rolled out of the ring most of the time. 
I, I nearly forgot he's in the match. I really hated what they did with Jericho. Like, yeah, it's really damn bad. So that pissed me yeah, off as well. Yeah, I don't well. know what they I mean, were they thinking. Did it for the sake of the record, you know, they needed to break the record of Jericho, the longest Royal Rumble man, 61 minute guy. Uh, but I, I just feel felt weird. I hate when they do it. <laughs> comes below what you hated about Royal Rumble 2017. Because even though it was good, lots of great matches, great spots. But some of the bullshit just ruined it. <laughs> Roman Reigns. I'm, I will get comments saying you hate Roman Reigns. I unsubscribe. But that's the truth. I don't hate the guy. I don't hate his uh, uh, wrestling ability or anything. It's just his push is ruining wrestling. It, it, it really is. It's the truth. Make sure to click that bell to get all my videos early. All of me on Twitter. The great one. Peace. I love and hugs. You know, there's a reason why... This company is failing because of two, three people, John Cena, Roman Reigns, and Vince McMahon himself. The three stooges, the three cancers, the three diseases to this company is going to continue, well, it's going to keep continuing to slap the fans in the face until this company dies. And it's quite obvious to me that this company is already dying ever since it went PG. And the word Romo shows just that. I've officially lost my interest in the product. I'm going to stop watching SmackDown until either Cena turns heel or get the title taken away from him. That's the only way. So I think that it's best for me to take a break from Raw. And uh oh not not Raw but from WWE in general. I guess I'll just watch the old you know, the old school wrestling like the attitude era and the the new the new generation era. You know, the ruthless aggression era. Um, yeah. Um, hope you all enjoy my reactions. You already know what to do. Subscribe. Leave your comments. Hit the like button. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram. The link is in the description. Uh, see y'all. Maybe next time.